All right, here we go again. Okay, this is my Energenics Fedini. Fedini SG4 transistor experimenter board. I got it at the Energy Conference in Hayden, Idaho. Put it together. They didn't have the directions yet. They're going to email them to me, but I couldn't wait. So here's the coil I purchased. Here's the board I put together. Run battery. Charge battery. Charge battery sitting at 12.9. Okay. The output, instead of going straight to the charge battery, goes to one lead of this capacitor that I got out of a microwave oven. It is a uh, 1900 volts AC, 0.84 microfarads. It has a resistor built into it, so it, it drains itself out when it's disconnected. All right, so on the output of that is a high voltage diode that come for the microwave. That outputs to the positive of the charge battery to charge the battery. All right, now the fun thing is, is when I start this thing up, which we'll do, we'll put it into variable mode we'll give the wheel a spin we'll tune it up oh there it goes self oscillation now I can turn the wheel off I don't need the wheel anymore continues to run without the wheel run spinning and I can tune it down Turns the sound down a little bit, makes the light go brighter. I can tune it up, makes the sound go higher, and the light go dimmer. But, oh, and we are charging, we are now up to 1294. I like the light a little bit brighter. So, we'll put it about there. It just hums along without the wheel spinning. Oh, now we're up to 12.95. And it'll continue to charge the battery without the wheel, which I find very interesting. So I think I've got it running in uh, the third mode, but I'm not forcing it back onto the charge battery or run battery. So I don't know. I'll continue to experiment if anybody knows why it's self oscillating instead of needing the wheel and it won't continue to push the wheel but it runs without the wheel 1296 um, let me know thanks